up next, it's a welterweight bout between Bruce Lee and Eric Silva. Well, good to see this young fighter make the walk here tonight. His takedowns are really some of the best in the game. So explosive, great technique behind them. Certainly, you see shades of his collegiate wrestling career. His opponent's got to watch out for those, but even an opponent with good takedown defense will succumb to this guy's shots. No telegraph behind him. When this guy wants to take you down, more often than not, he succeeds. This guy has ridiculous hand speed. His opponent is gonna need to keep his chin tucked and his hands up high. Here he is, the founder of Jeet Kune Do, and as Dana White calls him, the father of modern mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee making the walk tonight. You can make the argument no man has had as much of an influence on UFC fighters as Bruce Lee has. Quoted as saying, the best fighter is someone who can adapt to any style. Man, it would have been great to see what Bruce Lee could have done inside the UFC. He is making the walk tonight. Apparently, he worked tremendously hard on cardio for this camp. Tail of the tape for this highly anticipated welterweight fight. Two years apart, these two fighters, with some differences in height and a similar reach. All right, we send it inside the octagon to the veteran voice, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, her team. And now! This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. <laughs> Team wins, nine losses, and one no contest. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting at a Villa del Hall, Espelito Santo, Brazil, Eric Silva! And now we can see his opponent fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee! You've been given your instruction in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. This, this has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in because it's about to go down to right now. Ready. Here we go. Spinning back kick to the bottom. on the straight right here. Silva gets absolutely melted by that head kick. Beautiful inside leg kick. Lee gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. 
He, he landed a left hand there. Neither guy really finding their range with much consistency here early. Kick lands for him there. Oh, yeah, these are so what you say about my mother punches. Joe. Well, that kick landed the body. Oh! This could be it! Big kick, but miss. Lee gets absolutely pelted by that head kick. Nice inside leg kick. How about that shin? Strong kick there. Well played oh, on the Oh, very nice. Powerful right hand. This could be it right here. Wow! That one hurt him badly. High-level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by Silva. Trademark inside leg kick there by Lee. So the kick lands to the body yet again, Joe, and despite his corner's best efforts to try to get him to lower that guard, he's not doing it. Very vulnerable, leaning in, and his opponent took full advantage there. Knee to the body. Good combination so far from both men. Seconds left. Head kick! Ten seconds to go in the round. He's fainting with that kick. Okay, he's got a nice snap to that leg kick. Very nice. That horn sounds means we have reached the end of round one. you to set those kicks up a little bit better. Now let's take a look here. And here's a big strike to the head that stuns. And here's another devastating shot to the head that really does damage. And here's another shot to the head that really stuns. Brittany Palmer with us. Ready to fight? Ready. 
Here we are, early round two. Now, starting off this round, you've got to think that the barrage that he endured in that last round is still affecting him. He's going to want to start this round off and move and avoid taking any damage. Effective punch there by Silva. Well, Joey seems to have his opponent's timing down. He has landed some good shots, but nothing really in terms of multi-shot combinations, and perhaps that's why his opponent's still standing. So perhaps at this point, he could change up the power with which he throws some of these strikes, maybe alter the tempo a little bit, and try to make it so it's not just one and done when it comes to his striking attack. Well, he got his head snap back there, Joe. The straight punch lands flush to the head. And again, he's just not doing things defensively that you want to see. Move that upper body. Get that head off of the center line. Right now, he's just leaning right into his opponent's range. Oh, caught him there with the head kick. That's, again, the experience. Lee's bruise on that thigh certainly bears watching. That looks about as bad as it could. He's going to have fun walking him off. How about that chin? Under three minutes now to go in the round. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, beautiful, beautiful kick to the body. And he's looking for that left. Visibly limping here. Lee gets punished by the uppercut there. That one's going to leave a mark. Well, he has really picked up the pace here. And oh, jumping knee! Body kick, look at that! Two minutes now to go round two. Kick to the head. He's hurt. He's stunned. He's got him hurt here. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Hard straight punch. Oh! 90 seconds now remain in the round. He faints with the kick. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Oh, he's hurt. Can he hang on? Nice leg kick. with that hook, but misses. And a nice jab. <laughs> 30 seconds to go now. He tagged him again. He's hurt. He is clearly in big, big trouble here. Big body shot, shot by. Oh, we heard him again. And 
What a run! And here's a nice shot, lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Very impressive striking going on in that round. Ariane Celeste is holding it down. Third round underway. That last round was absolutely insane. If this round gets off to anything like the last round, one of these guys is going out. I can't imagine a scenario where if they can... Whoa! Oh, man! He is in deep danger right now. Deep danger. Whoa! He hurt him! Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Total strikes. Lands the kick to the body there. Going to the kick here, Joe. Well, oh, just a huge right hand! He is stumbling. Oh! What a leg kick! Oh! He's in big trouble. to go in round three. Side control. Under three minutes now to go in the round. Well, he's in north-south now. Let's see if he can hold it. Oh, good punches from the top here. In half guard. Man, doesn't take a lot of these kicks to produce redness. Look at the left side of his body there. Nasty. Back to the feet now. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. Really starting to pile up these body shots here in the latter stages of this fight. You didn't see a lot of that in the earlier rounds. Making up for lost time here. Just misses with the straight left hand. Oh, strong hook to the head there by Silk. Oh! Oh, caught a big right hand. Lee's leg appears to be hurt here, Joe. That is an obvious win.
So, Joe, yet again, he moves right into that straight punch, and these are really starting to add up. He's going to have to figure some things out defensively, lean on the corner a little bit, but ultimately just move that upper body and move those feet, get that head off the center line. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. He lands the head kick. Really missed with that right hand. Well-placed kick there by Lee. That one hurt. Whoa! Ten seconds to go here. Let's see what happens. Oh, very nice. What a round. Hey, stop. There's a nice kick to the body. Here's a nasty kick to the body. Here we see an excellent kick connects flush with perfect timing. The original Ariane Celeste, good to have her in the building as usual. for five five-minute rounds. Very rare technique. You don't see too many guys throwing that side kick. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Oh! oh! He's definitely hurt. Big shots! Oh! Back up to his feet. Nice leg kick. Kick to the body. Oh! Oh, he hurt him. Bad. Bad. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Look oh! at He hurt him. Silva goes for the clinch now, Joe. He was stunned. Now let's see if this gives him time to recover. He lands a big shot from the bottom. That eye is going to be grotesque. Silva's got the double underhooks here on the clinch now, Joe. Let's see what he can do with it. Pummels under. Maintains the underhook. Makes it in some shoulder strikes there. Lee gets the over-under here in the clinch, Joe. Now let's see what he can do with it. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Silva's got double underhooks now. And they separate. He gets hit with a kick. That looked like it hurt you. It he looked like him. it did stun him a little bit. He's trying to stay up. Body kick, look at that. Three minutes remain in the run. I mean, the hand speed, just absurd. He hurt him again! He's definitely blocked. Oh! oh! That is incredible! That is it! Landed a hard kick for the knockout. Yeah, Joe, this fight was over as soon as that kick made contact. And you want to credit the offense and not denigrate the defense, but he did not get the guard up. And against this type of striker, you are absolutely playing with poison. So a near-perfect kick spells the end of this one here tonight. Let's take a look at that again. Great angle here. I mean, just stiff. So a huge result and a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the big knockout win. That could hold up as one of the better KOs of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 11 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon. Well, what else can you say about